What's going on, viewers for the internet? I'm VarityGamer95, back with some more Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Okay, so last time, after making my preparations to start Chapter 5, we went through a whole ordeal just to get Admiral Bobbery, a salty old bomb sailor, sailor, sailor <laughs> to join our crew. This time, we have nothing else to do, so let's shove off. So, are you all ready for an epic voyage, then? Yeah, let's shove off. Very well, to the sea! Raise Acre sets hills with thrills and emotion. And robots and Muddy, our destination is Drake Q Hokey! Wait up! Remember guys, once you begin chapter 5, you won't be able to return to Rogue Port until it's done. Make your preparations in advance, like I did. Alright, here we go, on to our next chapter. This is X01 here. Come back, dude. I repeat, X1 X01 here. Over. Roger, reading you five by. Infiltration is successful. X not black aboard vessel. Repeat, X not black is on board the vessel. Chapter five. The key to pirates. Month, star, day, X circle. Over the protest of a crew, the SS Flavion has set sail. Is is this voyage as reckless as they say? Ha! Ah, have a scuff! Flavio will show them guts! Month, star, day, double X. No dear, good wind. White clouds, they dazzle me. It is as if they're a blessing of voyage. Flavio thanks them most heartily. Month star, day, X music note. Things are going smoothly, yet I fill with dread. At this speed, we should reach a destination by tomorrow's sunrise. Skull Captain casts his gaze, Red Jewel shines and plays, Boom Bust a Boom Festival! The Stash Brothers' best of friends, Three times Red Stash lands at his end. Blue Stash's belly four times is whacked, so let's hear this fireworks go BOOM! At the Boom Boss of Boom Festival! Yes, now we are talking! Five you told you, did he not? Nothing to fear, no? The island is right before our eyes. Do you not see it? It is a mountain of treasure! Ho oh, ho ho! I feel fabulous! Shall I tell you one of my many, many tales of raw bravery? No, it is no trouble at all! There was locked in deadly combat with the sea serpent! Yes, but even then I smiled, for I knew I'd prevail. Great, he started clear. again. A tale of bravery, well, right? Flavia. I heard this he one yesterday. Strength, massive, a huge drink of mandy. There's nowhere to escape to. You, you know? just have to listen to it at least until it's finished. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah, if you interrupt him, it's story, he absolutely loses it yes, too. Yes. Uh, why is the... Wait, what's going on here? The ship's stopping. Oi, Master Flavio, all of a sudden you interrupt that wicked story. But the ship stopped. Huh? Stop to say to me after you the story of passion and fury. Well, it is your job to keep the ship moving, yes? Mm hmm? So take care of it! Oh, why, I love you. I'll get on it right quick. Wait a tick. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. Just wait a Google stop a minute, you scallywags. Oi! Quit shoving, eh? I'm working over here! I said quit shoving! Uh, ah! Th th they're here! What is this ruckus now? Who is here? Well, someone tell me what is going on! No, no, they're upon us. The pirate goes. 
Oh, the rumors were true! Well, uh, what do we do? We gotta get out of here! No! Do, do, do not panic yourselves! This is just a dream that we're all having! Oh, wait! No, no, no! Quickly, quickly! We're the boat! Oh! Ghostly Omic thing! Are you really the Savage Pirate King? Ah! Help me! Fuck up now, everyone! Very civilized! Relax! No panic! Relax, 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 I say! You said it was taking easy! Er. What? Vlog! Excuse me! Listen, everyone! If we can form an orderly line without shoving. Forget that! Make a path! Bobbery! Look alive, man! Hey! We must get out of here! A bad ship! Every wish Bobbery is virtue for himself! Month star, day X star, fortune from disaster, the currently sea washed us ashore. What strange irony that this island was our intended destination all along, no? And yet we mourn, we have lost three crew members, including Admiral Bobbery. It pains me to think they were taken by the Pirate King, that ghostly thing. What happens to us now, huh? We may have lost that hope, stricken in the wilds. Month star, day X heart, we have made a semblance of civilized life here. The ship's flotsam have washed in, and now we have salty bread and other salty things. We can live for some time with the salty bounty of the sea, but then what, I ask? Month star, day double circle. We have built a, filled a few huts for the washed up timbers. Ah, oh, poor sweet us is Bobbyon. At least the shanties will keep out the wind and rain. We saw we had no second Bobbery with the others, and my heart, she doubts. Still, despite my fears, we must continue to hope that they are alive somewhere. Month star, day, circle X. Three days in the aisle now, and the huts are all finished. We have carved a life out, out here that we don't dream of a return to Rogueport. Kill Hall Key. Oi, Captain Stash! It ain't much, but we finished a wee hut for you to rest in. Come have a look. There's really nothing we can do except move on. All right. So, it's interesting how <laughs> it, that didn't take away our items, but that's the way it works. So this is the fabled Keelhole Key we heard of back in Chapter 3, huh? Captain, please help us! Flavio and Papatch are in a huge fight! Hey, what about you, Squinty? You turned to jelly when you saw all those ghosts! What are you talking about? You are the one quaking in his boots, fancy pants! Wait! Wait one moment! Did... Did you just call the great Flavio your fancy pants? That's right, fancy pants! Fancy pants! Fancy pants! Fancy pants! Fancy pants! Why, you little Cyclops! Flavio demands satisfaction! You, me, Hammers, and Dawn! Oi, oh, that's right, fine by me! I can't wait to put a few dents in those fancy threads! They're here! G -g -g Captain Stash! Them ghosts are back! Hey, look at these guys. M Mario, if you're flying center, this is in the water! Take care of those ghosts! You mean me? Yep, he means me! Can't flee this fight. Thank God for quick change, am I right? Thankfully. Right? Let's tell these guys. So these are the embers that we heard of back in the Pit of 100 Trials. Got it. That's an ember. Sorry for pale blue flame spirit. Kind of spooky. Message piece A attack is 3, defense is 0. Of course, since this thing is a flame, touching it will hurt. Didn't Mama teach you that? Looks like it's susceptible to ice or explosive attacks though, so that's something. If you get hit by a flame attack, you'll catch fire, so try to guard well. Let's see, well, Koos is the only one who can deal with these guys, so go to him. Oh, we can't jump on him. So, I can at least try to whittle down their health. Let's do a super hammer. There we go, every little bit of damage counts. 
Yeah, yeah, that's the other attack that he, uh... Oh, God. That's the other attack that the uh, embers can do. They actually have two of them. Wow. I mean the lava bubbles, not the embers. All right, it's power shell. There we go. All right, so let's do the super hammer again. They'll bring it down to three. Woo! So one of those down. Look at that. All right, perfect. So this is it's going to give us nine star points. All right. So Kusu cool wrapping up with the power shell. Blam! There we go. All right, nine star points for our trouble. Getting closer to our next level up. Yes, you're a blue -blue beast, Captain Stash. Too early to celebrate, nope. There are surely more than most were, huh? Some of us sophisticate the rest of the island. Yes, that is what must be. As leader of this expedition, I of course stay here. On this, I broke no argument. Ah, yes, of course. Mario, perhaps you can help the exploration of this island. No way, pal! Ah, well, we can't just sit here and set ourselves all day like mermaids, huh? Some of us get out there and look around. This is not a thing to be argued. So, we'll decide this fair square, hmm? Everyone, all in favor of Mario exploring the island? Please raise your hands! Oh, boy! Oh, heck look, yes! Pal. Ah, there you have it! We all count upon you! Good luck, bold explorer! It's always me who has to do all the work, huh? Big surprise. We're going to be coming across a couple of different enemies here. In this tropical island. So, remember when I said that, uh... We would have access to a storage. Here we go. This is where we can access our storage. So these are the items that we have available. So you sell super shrooms and honey syrups. And if we need to fully recover our health, we have this inn that's over here. See? I don't believe that will be overly necessary, especially considering I'm close to a level up. Okay. Ah! Uh, it's the green fuzzy that we fought back in the glitz pit. Come on, you bastard! Really? That's what I was trying to spin jump you! Okay, well, he's all alone. He only has 5 HP. There we go. Oh, uh, did I say jungle fuzzy? I meant green fuzzy. Jungle fuzzy is the yellow one from the last game, Joseph. See, there is another enemy that we will come across here. Hey, a badge! Head rattle! Execute superbly to confuse enemies. Okay. Let me double check that I got a spike shield equipped. Yes, I do. Because... I don't want to grab that. Because... Let's see. Well, I couldn't find it. There we go. But there's going to be a piranha plant type enemy here. Oh, God. That one has a freaking... Uh, that one's got a freaking ice storm. So I definitely want to take care of you. A spin jump can... Spin jump can handle you. There we go. See, well, that's not gonna be able to show off the Flower Fuzzy's attack, huh? So check this out. Bam! See, it actually took our FP. So I believe that icon is actually unique to this particular enemy. Oh, hey, look at that! We just leveled up. I should have taken out Coops so that he could recover as well. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and equip, or equip, increase. I'll increase BP. You'll see why in a little bit. Hopefully it won't be too much longer, but I think it's going to be another part. Okay, that's why I want to have Koops out so that I could just recover his health for free. Okay, but I guess it couldn't be helped. That wasn't thinking things through. See, I do believe this is where we're, here we go, Yes! That's a pretty colorful looking prime plant, don't you guys think? And there's three of them. Blam! Oh, here we go. Nice. See here. The putrid piranha. Wow, that looks quite a bit different from the last game, huh? Got it. That's a putrid piranha. It's a poisonous prime plant. That color is totally sickly. Message please eight, attack is three, defense is zero. It bites and it attacks with super rank poison breath. Breath mint table four. 
If you get poisoned, your HP will slowly go down, so, you know, try not to. Alright, uh, what can we do with these, uh, putrid piranhas? So, uh, you notice that their teeth are pointing up? You cannot jump on the putrid piranhas in this game. In the first Paper Mario, you are free to do that. Because their teeth weren't, you know, pointing upward like the normal piranha plant was. Oh, I was expecting the poison breath, sir. Let's see here. So, I'm gonna go ahead and... I could swap to the Yoshi Kid. Let's swap to the Yoshi Kid. I'm gonna have him do Gulp. Oh, let's have him do Mini Egg. Reduce their attack power. Let's see here. Nice! Got them Got them both, okay. So now they're tiny! Aw, ain't they cute? Go to Koops. Let's smash into smithereens! Or I guess smash into a pile of goop, I guess. Okay. The poison breath is, I believe, uh, a piercing attack as well. It's just not doing any damage to these guys because blocking still reduces damage by one. Good thing that still holds true at least. Okay, I actually didn't time it right. Oh, it's a good thing I'm gonna end this battle, huh? I don't want that happening again. <laughs> not again, please. That would actually put Koops in danger. It brings HE down to five. Uh, so we have a farm fuzzy that's just uh that's just hanging out here, huh? Let's see, well, we need to hit this invisible block. Well, goodbye to the coins. <clears throat> Good thing I got a spike shield equipped, huh? Oh, give me a break! Are you serious, game? Uh, yeah, that figures I would miss, my god. Uh. Okay, so, um, so there's actually something that the game doesn't tell you about Gale Force. See? Gale Force can actually remove the fog. Oh, nice! I actually got rid of the green fuzzy, okay. That was actually who I wanted to get rid of. Okay, so reduce damage, nice. Oh, okay. Wow, I didn't think it was going to work quite that well. Okay, well, I did end up, uh... I did end up getting rid of my intended target. Let's do Power Shell. There we go. Okay, mistimed it. Let's just get rid of the first guy, huh? Bam! There we go. Alright, that one damage could still make a difference, though. Uh, I really don't want to waste my FP on that. Ooh, this could be nice if I can actually get it. Let's see here. Nope, I missed it, okay. But I'm going to get Koops' health back. Because I failed before, you know. Alright, so now we're getting 8 star points. Oh, so we're getting the coins, okay. I, did, I thought I was going to be forced to miss it. So I believe that Flower Fuzzy... You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> what?! Wait, there was a star piece there?! Are you serious?! How many invisible star pieces have we got to come across this game?! <laughs> anyway, I was saying earlier... I believe that Far Fuzzy is there, <laughs> uh, just in case he actually missed his first jump with the Yoshi Kid. There we go. It's actually kind of hard to uh, decide who I want. Hello? Hello, hello, hello! What do we have here? I missed it! No, I didn't! Shine Spray. Alright, and there's at least one more Shine Spray that we'll be coming across. I can't believe I made that. There's at least one more chance for them to come across this chapter. So, we definitely... We'll definitely have enough to do, uh... Something good. This cursed ghost! Blast it all! 
Hey, look who it is. Alright, blow for his blotches! Is that Mario over there? You're alive, old boy! Right, you can't just the nick of time. Get these two out of here this instant! Huh? But what about you, Admiral? You gotta get out of here too! Just leave it to me, eh? I'll keep these ghouls busy while you get out of here! Free! That's in order! Let me do what I must do! Now, we're away with you! Ah! Well, Bobbery here thinks it's the right thing to do, so what are we waiting for? Oh, Bobbery, please forgive our cowardice! We up, up and left you, and everything's happening so quickly. Forgive us! Well, unfortunately, I am going to miss out on some pretty good dialogue from Miss Mouse, because I thought we were going to fight here. Gone, eh? Excuse me, but I better be going awesome. And hey, you! Out there for the TV! Yeah, I'm talking to you! It may be pretty obvious to you who I really am, but don't tell me Mario. Or else! You out there referring to the TV? Um, is that guy okay, you think? <laughs> Basically, Miss Mouse would say, I think I have, I think he has the sea madness. I honestly thought we were going to have to fight those guys. Now, that being said, I do do want the Yoshi kid out. Wow, um, I didn't think I was going <laughs> to... <laughs> what the hell was that, Joseph? <laughs> What the hell was that? You need to get on the Yoshi kid first. <laughs> I just up and <laughs> I just up and went to the water. <laughs> anyway, uh, um, hold on, hold on. So, um, you want to go back to that island there and get a coconut from this tree. It's not apparent why, but trust me, you want to do this. A coconut, fruit from a tropical island. To be honest, it ain't tasty. It doesn't say it, but the coconut restores 5 HP. Just like a mushroom. Yeah, they changed its purpose in this game. It was a battle item in the first game, but now it's a healing item in this game. Okay, so that's not how I want to get that badge over there. You want to go over here, go into paper mode. Ice power. Make Mario damage proof for jumping with fire enemies. This is why I quit BP. Or increase BP. And, let's see here. You know what? I am going to equip charge partner. Because I would like to actually show off. Well, no. I can't do that. Soft stomp, happy heart, multi bounce. Oh sure, I'll equip happy heart. So hop up the sprite. Are you serious? I already have my sixth shine sprite. Oh, this is great. I can already do what it is that I want to do. Erg, erg, erg. So this is how Legend of the Sea beats his end, eh? Sounds like Bobbery's in trouble. Let's see here. Gotcha! Alright. Let's show off ice power! Woo! Wait, I did it! Normal jump? There we go, ice power, see? Let's just safely jump on fire enemies, no problem. Woo! Bam! You know what? I think that even increases his power against fire enemies, too. Power show! There we go. So that's two of them down already, nice! Okay, nice. All right, I'm gonna go and let's see here. Yeah, ice power increases the damage against fire enemies by one. Doesn't actually say that in the description. All right. So it doesn't actually say that. Oh, it does. Oh, it. I don't remember it saying that honestly. Make Mario damage proof for jumping at fire enemies. Attack card against fire enemies increases by one, and damage taken for, damage take for fire attacks drops by one. Hammer the tree. Ooh, the pain of it all. 
Ooh, Mario, oh boy. Ugh. 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 I guess those blokes got me a bit better than I thought. Mario, please hear my last request. I must thank you for taking me out to sea one last time. But there is one thing I need before I go to my rest. Chocola Cola. I was saving that one bottle of my last memory of Scarlet to celebrate Reggie here. I saw it among the flats that drifted toward the island, so it must be somewhere. If I might have just one sip before my final voyage. <laughs> Give me that Chocola Cola, old boy. Let's see here. What do you have to say about him, Gubella? That's Admiral Bobbery. He came with us on the ship, don't you remember? He washed ashore with the rest of us, but he seems hurt. You think he's doing okay? Well, um, back to camp for us, I guess. Let's go report back to Flavio. Those enemies would respawn, wouldn't they? There's a treasure here? Are you serious? Oh, it's right here. Star piece. Okay. So that's nine, huh? Oh, Bobbery! No, not you. Admiral Bobbery. Whatever happened to him? Let's talk to Flavio. Ha! Ah, you are still alive! Well, we have some fortune left! Such relief for Flavio! I thought some jungle beast was snacking on you! Well, everyone is accounted for! Now, wait one moment! Am I wrong, or are we still one man short? Th th that's right! But, but Bobby sacrificed some to save us with the ghosts! Please! We've got to go back and help him! What lunacy bursts forth from your mouth! The animal lives! What fortitude! Mario, friend setter, I trust you with the mission to save our dear Admiral! Huh? What is that you say? Chocola Cola? Well, why would I have that? But, er, yes, by the way, Flavio is merely curious. What do you need it for? What now? The Admiral will soon perish, and he wants to drink it as his last wish. Ah, so what we're dealing with here is a sort of last request, am I correct? Well, Flavio has no choice. I found it beach, but for this noble cause, I yield. However, this Chocola Cola is part of my, er, I mean, our supplies, which we need to survive. So, I would need you to find something to eat to replace this. On this, I do not budge. Hmm, yes. I am sure there is something on this island that would be a suitable replacement. So, remember that coconut that I got, that I got earlier? So, what will we give in exchange for this delectable Chocola Cola, hmm? Make it good! I am the editor of Foppish Grooming Weekly, so I know my delicacies! Here's a coconut, sir! Ah! Ha! A coconut, is it not? Well, that is island fare, but somewhat cliched! How ah, well, perhaps that's somewhat hosted high for a foraging non board man such as you! Well, here you go! Take the Chocola Cola, and give him a gross to the Admiral! Chocola Cola, Fabio's treasured beverage. Actually, it's Bobberies. This is actually a bottle of wine in the Japanese version. It even looks like that here in the North American version. But for this version, they changed it so that it's a reference to Mario Luigi Superstar Saga, which came out the year before this, 2003. Time to waft the bouquet, swizzle it gently, and savor all the fizz fine fizziness. Oh yeah, he's going to do that, all right. All right, so we need to head back to Admiral Bobbery. Let's give him the Chocola Cola, or... <clears throat> the bottle of wine. Are you serious? Two star pieces in the same room? So that's what his mouth with. It never ends. <laughs> it's a running gag at this point. I swear to God, it never ends. I'll be back. Okay, back to where I was. I got into a fight back there and used some of my star power, but you can see with stylish commands how easily I got it back. As I also appealed back there as well. All right. Here you go, sir. Hmm? Ah, the distinctive bouquet. You... You've brought it. Oh. Ah, that glorious flavor, dear boy. It awakens the mouth. So, the sea was generous enough to deliver me this one last grace, eh? I have nothing left in this world now. Thank you for granting my last wish. Now I shall be reunited with my dear Scarlet. Farewell, Captain Mario. Is he actually dead, though? Hmm. Hmm. 
Mario, sweetie, I believe Barbary may just be sleeping. Yes, in fact, I'm positive, and after all that worry, spank him awake, sweetie. Wham! Huh! 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 What? Yobbity yobbity! Pirates! What are those pirates? Barbary, he's not quite up to speed, I don't think. What now? Oh, Mario, old boy, it's you. You have, you have adventures in the afterlife as well? Capital! Such melodrama. You're still alive, dearie. Ah, hmm, yes. Whoa, really? This is the tropical paradise of fallen sailors? Oh, right. Now I recall. Mario, old boy, we still have work to do. You'd better take me with you, I should say. I'm sure my sea legs explosive personality would be rather useful, eh? Barbary, join your party. He could be either the 6th or 7th party member, depending on how you go about getting Miss Mouse. So we finally have our bob on buddy. Barbary's abilities, a primer. Press X to make Mario throw Barbary, who will then walk a few steps to explode. Notably, Mario will toss him above him. Use Barbary's explosions to blast cracks open, destroy walls, and activate switches. You can even throw him onto ledges above you. In battle, he can detonate on ground-bound enemies. Or, if you like, you can use his bomb squad. Time bombs explode one turn later. There we go. So, Bobbery will come with us starting at 20 HP. When upgraded fully, he will have the highest HP of all the party members at 40. So, um, <laughs> the thing about that Chocola Cola, or, <clears throat> you know, the wine, um, like a year or two ago, that's at the time that I'm recording this, I remember seeing in my family's fridge what I thought, oh god, what I thought was grape soda. So, I was, what the hell, you son of a bitch, you piece of crap, well, at least I have an excuse to show up Bobbery in battle. So, check this out. So we have Bomb, attack a ground bound foe with an explosion, and Bomb Squad. Throw three time bombs that will explode one turn later. Press A with good timing. Let's see. See, I was never really the biggest fan of this ability. I don't think, really think it's that great. But I figured I might as well show it off at least once, you know. Alright, let's see here. Ugh. Three, huh? Now, the funny thing is, even though bob is getting a point of defense in this game, Bobbery doesn't have one. Like, he doesn't have defense, and I don't know why. Koos is the only partner who has defense. So I'm gonna put Mario in the front, take care of this flower fuzzy, and how about show off Bobbery's appeal? We saw part of it. Now, here's, here's all of it. Boom! See? Ah, I did that because I don't know if it's going to trigger the uh, the bomb squad. See? Well, <laughs> that clearly was pretty much for nothing, huh? Finally, let's show off Bobbery's uh, bomb. It's like a grand throw with an explosion. Press A, release the light. Star lights up. You have to hold it, just like so. Now, um, unlike Bombette, where he has to tap the A button to use her bomb, Bob uses just a simple hold. It's a bit easier. No, it's much easier. What am I saying? Ah, uh, that freaking son of a bitch. So, I actually remember that the Fire Fuzzy could be in one of three places. The second one is to have the cliff where you need to cross the yellow block to reach with the Yoshi Kid. Well, I want to grab this. Ugh. Oh, is this a courage shell? I don't... I don't really want that. Whatever. Alright. Back we go. Let's see here. Hey, is it that? Bobbery? Hey, he's been alive all this time. Really? Unless... That's his ghost! Oi, who's that behind you? Why, that's Bobbery, that is. Welcome back, old bomb. Good old Bobbery, he's safe. <laughs> Yay! I thought he was a donor for sure. I was threw up. I was so worried. 
Ah, it is Barbary. Welcome back to you. Do you know how worried we were? Our stomach has been most upset. I must worry about everyone here, but who was for Fabio? No one. Do you know how hard that is for me to sit here in safety and worry so much? I don't know what is out there waiting to lurch in and snack upon me. We do not even know how to get home for the sake of the blue bright you see. But no more yelling. Now is the time to pull together and work as a team. Fabio, old boy, I must say, you talk rather too much. Such insolence! Arrgh! I grow at you like an angry jungle beast. I ought to. So in any case, Mario, about that crystal star you spoke of earlier. There was a rather odd rock at the far east of the jungle with a skull carved into it. Call it an old sea bomb's intuition, but that skull rock smells suspicious. <laughs> hey, Bobbery, you want to know what really smells suspicious? Fabio's armpit. Oh, it smells like low tide. <laughs> but seriously, you may be onto something with that skull rock. I see that's where the treasure is. Well, anyone can figure that out, you, you mutinous joker. I mean, how obvious! I was already saying in my head that the treasure is certainly behind that rock. And as such, I will continue the noble duty of protecting this camp from invasion. Captain Mario, carry on. I am sorry to make so many requests, but you know. Fabio, you old cash grubber. If you want treasure, why don't you go get it yourself? Oh, well. Yes, uh, Hagro. You see, I... Well, yes, you have a point. Let's decide this fan square, shall we? Listen to me, everyone. Who thinks I should go along to investigate the Skull Rock? Oh, heck yes! yes. Thank I'm you. Thank you. you. There you have it, Flavio. Fair and square, eh, what? Um, no. Not fair. Flavio hates you all. Flavio will join you for a short time. And just so it's out of the way... The Yoshi Kid is a pint-sized powerhouse. <laughs> and apparently so is Mario's shoulders. Like, oh my god. Like, seriously, how do you even pull this off? But, I think it's going to be saved for next time, alright? Oh, hold on. Something else that I can do real quick. Let's go ahead and recover with Flavio and the party. Watch this. <laughs> Flavio will go into Mario's pocket, just like the other party members do. Also, yes, that's what happens when you stay in an inn. Nothing special. Alright, fully recovered, and we're ready to go for next time. So next time, Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door, let's investigate the skull rock of the edgy island, huh? See you then.